business time. Dark Maxi is unfolding. Oh, they've got the wrong flag. Oh, no, they haven't. I got, I got fooled. <laughs> we got bamboozled. Right, so this is definitely a slower matchup than what we've just seen. A uh, lot of fight for the stage, which Maxi's having trouble with right in the middle. She definitely a character oh, you can get right rests on, though, and that is one right out of the gate. No big punishes here for Sheik. Another key factor in this matchup, right? That was 13% rest punish, something like that. Really not a big deal. So if you are able to land the rest, it's incredibly significant. Sheiks are also notoriously not a fan of this matchup, especially not just in NTSC, but more so in PAL as well. It's without up air, without yeah. follow-ups, it's pretty difficult. Yeah, yeah. And most significantly in NTSC, you have down throw into up air or fair to finish yeah. off the kills, whereas down throw does not give you any real follow-up with appropriate DI, yeah. especially the hype sense. It means like it, I think it also. Oh yeah, really no, I don't. The thing is, right? I respect that choice yeah. because look, you just took 18%. Yeah, no it's, big deal it's at no all. Big he's gonna get it. He's gonna get it. Oh, and overdies off the top. That means he's gonna wake up. No punish at all. 64% here. I mean, Pop is able lead. to force a lot of risk, higher, like kind of low risk, high reward situations against Sheik. Yeah. Right? Um, and the other thing is, the Sheik effectively has to be really, really good at playing patient if they're playing against a Puff. Not that Over Triforce himself isn't unaccustomed to playing like that, yeah. but it definitely will be a test of his mental fortitude. Certainly, certainly. He obviously well known with things we spoke about this a lot today. Uh, Edge Garda and Gimper Spaces, but he's definitely proficient in the other matchups, though perhaps not quite as strong. He's not known. Not quite known so for much. those, yes, yeah. certainly. He's not quite known for being. Extremely against the Yeah, over happy to go for the sort of uh, standing on the platform, throwing the needles down, cutting out a diagonal angle, preventing Maxi from approaching. Nice shield drop, and then, ooh, picks up the grab, Maxi here. Oh, oh very nice. strong. Maxi coming into the lead in this game one. Clean stock up on over Triforce here. Is this the tournament where over Triforce goes out seventh? Can, could you imagine that? What a nutty world. Yeah. Oh, yeah, Maxi getting caught there. It's one of the things Crouch Cancel on. No, sometimes at low percent you hit them. You do need to retreat still because they can just jump right back at you at zero. Oh, Maxi running low on jumps now. Has to air dodge. Oh, oh the over air dodge is off, and that's a do stock for Maxi. One SD in there. You got to count it, but that is still a win. A win is a win. Over skirting, he's shaking it off, you know? Yeah, he is, yeah. He is not sought to get shaken up. Oh, oh, Ooh. silent Johns. Nah, I, I, I think it was Maxi who turned on. Maybe it is. One. I thought he would have done it before because he did yeah, it as soon as we started playing friendly. So I'm surprised know. he got through the whole game without it, but we will see. Two, yeah. Two, that's interesting. Why do you think whoever's brought him here? Is it because I think the early rest, so he doesn't want to get ice or something, maybe? Possibly, sure. but I feel like that's not can't be too much of an issue. Once yeah. you've gone past about 20%, you're gonna die either way. I'm a little bit surprised with this tech, I'm not gonna lie. Certainly. I think maybe he's thinking he needs to maneuver around the platform. Maybe he wants more space. Yeah. Ah, uh, yeah, it's a tricky one. He, obviously, I don't think he wants FD because you don't have the platforms to do your needle movement. And then I can understand how he would shy away from a small stage like Yoshi's as well. So maybe he thinks the room's gonna help oh, him. Yes! Confident, confident, jumps always the edge. I see, taking his time. Now he's got the lead, happy to trade a few hits, I think, to build up some set on over Triforce. Really needs to take his time, getting back to the stage, yes. Classic, classic engagement there, right? You hit him, you hit your opponent coming back in, but there's such an open set, they just tank that hit and hit you straight back. Because you're on high percent, you're gonna die for it. I gotta respect that risk though. Like if I think if he didn't get counter hit, he could have up to rested. It's certainly, certainly. And you know, high percent sometimes it's worth taking those risks. There is a risk reward element to it for sure, but you just gotta be very aware when you're coming in from the outside. There's a very high chance that you just yeah, yeah. immediately you be, crouch cancel you and no, smack no. you back. You wanna be cognizant of it. Like, yes. like, you know, if, if you're like willingly taking that taking that risk, it's like all right. Oof. I see why. Yeah, Maxi fishing with that up tilt again. Up tilt and up air, both great moves for linking into rest and cheek. And obviously from the tech chases as we've seen many a time. Maxi controlling the space with his arrows here. I like how he's mixing up between using the bear and uh, throwing around with the nair as well. 
Ooh, yeah, catches the down smash, bit of a trade there. Okay, really just trying to really swipe each other out the air. Gets Sheik above him, but oh, smart there. Looked like he might have landed on the top platform. He just falls right the way through and then catches Max on the way down. This juggle is a really beneficial situation for Jigglypuff, though. I don't know how I feel about that crouch. I kind of respect it. <laughs> it's just like, you, it, well, he probably realized he's going to get hit, and then at the last minute, he just hit, went for it. So. Yeah, over trying to sneak his way in over the platforms, but Maxi is uh, giving him a, enough space to say, you know, I'm not going to get caught by your uh, little tricks. Oh, confident. Follows him in with the back air. Oh, oh, okay. It doesn't bounce him off the stage. I reckon Over's clocked onto that, actually, you know. I think Over saw it in the last game and said, if this happens again, I'm going to just hold up. So I get sent over the stage rather than into it. Really high percent, mate. Match here. Next hit's probably going to take it. No weak back air. Max is still alive. 1-6-1 one, one, or 1-6-1. One, one. Fair clinches it. Max in a tricky spot. He wants to take it quickly, but he needs to prioritize not taking too many hits. Ooh, catches him out of the snare. Yes. Managed to wake his way up to the platform. That is a tricky one on Dreamland, especially. In fact, I wouldn't be surprised if that was a factor in over Triforce's decision for the stage. You asked me about it. Yeah. When you upbeat to the platform, it is much harder for Jigs to get up there and rest you yeah, from the ledge. True. It's significantly higher than other stages. Oh, what kind of we get, though? Couple aerials and the stage. It's not it's bad. bad. Yeah. All right, I think it. Ooh, catches him coming with an air. Over Triforce doing the sneaky ledge dash where you just come, you only stay on the corner of the stage still. Shark? Oh, uh, yeah. Maxi only had a few jumps to play with there, so had to commit and then over catches him with a get up attack. Ooh, drill. Catches the grab. Over swings his way back in, though. Really nice spacing I'm seeing here from Maxi. It's a quite big change of pace from like, the last one as well. Both players kind of respecting each other's space a lot more, right? It feels like that. Ooh. Really, really back and forth game. Last time they was tied, they got to 116. They're both on the same, you know, this stock. Yeah, both in the 110s are over. I mean, it still might be a bit early to call it, but... I, w I could see, I, or at least I know Maxi would be willing to go to town. Yeah. I know he has it in him. Whether or not he'll go for it. Over as well. Like, I don't know if Over could, but I would think it's a valid choice to go for it in this position. Yeah. Especially if you get like 15 or maybe 30. Then it means well, if you do die, you've got the buffer room to still exactly, yeah. survive a few hits. Oh! Oh, that up air said she was down my spine. I cannot lie. Oh, comes in aggressively with the up air. Oh, goes for it, doesn't get it. So fully charges the needles and gets down smash. One hit, oh, and then the needles do connect. Oh, he's oh, pushing no. too far forwards. He's being a bit greedy, trying to get back to the stage there. He Can he make it? Oh, oh shield crab. Yeah, feel that was a fish for sure. He's got one. Yeah, no, he, he got the chance coming in, but he couldn't get his way back to the stage. Looking a little bit downcast, but... It's one to one. You're one to one against Over Triforce. You can't be too upset about that. You've got counter pick advantage. Exactly. <laughs> Looks like there's a battle going on in his head. Both of them looking like they're pretty mentally exhausted right now. Yeah. This is a grueling matchup to say the least. Certainly. Maxi having a drink of water, a little thick. It's good. Compose yourself. Yeah, certainly. I feel. Uh, I think he lost a little bit of composure right at the end, and that's yes, why he yeah. forced his way Yes, in, in the last Maybe 20 seconds, yeah, yeah, for sure. Like. It just felt like throughout the whole game, he was so content to, you know, play the stage game, play control, and then at the end, it just really fought his way in. It was like, he didn't have to. Right, he's taking his minute. Good shield dying on the grab, allowing, on the down smash, allowing him to get that grab. Whoa. Okay, definitely looking a bit frustrated himself. I don't think that's a real thing by any means, but... Oof. The eye away on the needles correctly there. That's... Oh, he missed the jump. Oh, he's really frustrated. Transforms his to get the forward air, but still not kill. I really want to see Maxi get... At least get to a, about... 
parity on this stock before he loses it. Because I feel like even if he loses the stock first, it's fine. But, okay, he's going up to 100. It's okay. Oh, wow. Maxi looking a bit... Uh, just watch that. Max, he's still got the stage, though. Okay. Comes back on. Yeah, goes to the ground. I respect it. Doesn't want to reach for the rest and get messed up. Doesn't want to frustrate himself anymore. And he has a good chance to close this out, I think, without taking another hit. Ooh, oh, oh. Well, he'll take that. Pan works out. Bit of the eye trap there, but, you know, he comes off for him. 50% is it's pretty negligible, honestly. This is good. Follows with the drill. Gets up till. Oh, finds, tries to find the pound, but it's not there. Maxi, a great utilizer of pound, for sure. Oh, drill into rest on the platform. That is some nice stuff. That is what we want to see. And he gets away with no punish. Tries to find another up air. Maybe he can get one more rest. That's what he's thinking about. But he does need to keep his cool. This is over Triforce he's playing against here. She using a back air. Excellent sort of behind and above hitbox for when Cheeky Puff is in the air above you. You turn around and you get the sort of upwards poking hit. Really trying to play some games here. Throws over above him, but can't get much of a follow up. Eats a fair, but isn't too much trouble. Maxi looking for over to roll in, but he's not having a bit. Fights his way inside instead. 